Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are having a great day. Um, today we are going to do a makeup tutorial and this is a day-to-day -day, um, makeup tutorial slash work um, makeup. However, it is going to look gorgeous still. And yeah, so let's get right into it. So first things first, we are going to be using, okay, we are going to be using the Instant Pore Eraser. This guys, I've had it for about a year. It's not getting finished because I don't use it every day. But um, this is um, a pore eraser and it's been helping me a lot. Sometimes I wear it alone just to minimize the pores and sometimes I wear it with makeup. So, guys, to talk about my skin, let's talk about my skin. For some months, like, okay, if you look at my previous videos, I've had had, like, I've had, like, the worst skin ever and um i was getting pores i was getting um bit like black mask i was getting black mask uh, um uh, marks all over my face and also my skin was just looking so terrible you guys until i came across this instagram account by the name of sisezide and I was like, okay, um, let me look at what this girl is selling. And I had, um, I saw that she was selling um, organic products. And um, I ordered, I actually tried out her, her black soap with um, a face scrub. So after using it, I'm seeing a lot of difference. I'm seeing a lot of like glow in my skin and i'm loving i'm just loving my skin you guys this was a big mug i had i don't know what caused it but when i went to the doctor um the doctor told me that i've got like too much stress i should lower my stress and try to do some activities so that i forget my problems i had a big mark on my face and i was like okay i was crying i was literally um crying and i didn't know what to do and then i was like on instagram like i told you guys so i ordered um a black soap with a mask i think the first time then i used that for about a week and i could see results guys my face feels so smooth and the black marks are going and I'm only left with just a, a few breakouts on my chin. Um, I'm sure that is because I'm on my period right now. But this wasn't here, darling. This wasn't here. So, let's get right. I'm going to leave every information. Maybe her link to her Instagram account or something for you guys to try out her products because they are working and i'm uh, like i'm looking to actually order myself a scrub as well because i saw that she has a face scrub so i'm looking to actually buy that from her so i'm just gonna dm her and actually ask her to give me more information on the products that she's selling so that i can leave it on the description below so that you guys can order yourselves a um, the products and actually also get a chance to improve your skin okay so let's get right into the makeup look i promised so the instant pore eraser and um, this is the maybelline new york instant pore eraser i'm just gonna use a little bit of it on my face just a little okay i'm going to apply that on my skin as well oh that feels so smooth you guys it's like it makes my face feel like a bum <laughs> baby's bum uh, 
um, it feels so smooth and as you guys can see it actually minimize the po minimizes the pores and yeah so I'm just gonna apply that on my forehead as well and around my eyes oh I love the feeling it gives me because my face feels so smooth you guys I'm loving it. Ooh. Secondly, I'm going to be using the Wet and Wild foundation. This I've had for about hmm, how many months now? I think it's about 10 months I've had this foundation. And it has also kept me because I had finished my infallible l'oreal but <laughs> let's go ahead and use this and yeah so i'm going to use a foundation brush it's dirty you guys but yeah we're going to apply foundation with this brush here so i'm just gonna take a bit of it girl the girl is running out of stuff, mommy. The girl is running out of makeup. Sana, a shopping is needed. Shopping spree is needed for makeup. Ah, uh -uh, son. I need to do something in this. Otherwise, hmm. We have you. So I'm just going to apply this using my foundation brush. I think I need just a bit because I'm looking to have that full coverage look. So I'm just going to use the brush and apply the foundation all over my face. Ooh, my under eyes, but my under eyes and yeah. Ooh. guys i'm balancing this phone eh? i'm balancing the phone with some stuff but now as i'm applying the foundation things are turning to disappoint yeah, well. okay um when you first apply this foundation eh, it looks greasy but as time goes on then it actually um gives you that matte um finish i hope you guys can see that it gives you that medium um coverage actually gives you that medium coverage okay let's go to this side as well because i lost my beauty blender that i had you know i tend to use the same brush and actually tap 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 or sometimes i use my fingers just to tap the foundation in Mm, that looks so good guys it looks so good so flawless it is important as well that you apply foundation on your on your um, cheek and on your neck as well so that it can actually blend together so I'm just gonna apply that okay foundation is now applied guys and you guys can see i look flawless now next up i'm going to be using my pro concealer la girl pro concealer this is in the color um beautiful bronze i don't wanna no let's change this um let me use this concealer here this is a revlon um medium deep um concealer 
so I'm just going to use this and apply under my eyes and yeah I'm applying this under my eyes and on my forehead as well down my nose and my chin not my chin just under wow. so i'm going to be using this um avon brush just to um set in but i think i would prefer using my hand because this is not wet so i'm going to use it for um the, the the powder later on so i'm going to use my hands for now and just dip i want to show you how this works wonders you guys where if you don't have a blender then you can use your hand and just try and blend the con the the concealer in uh try and blending that in i'm doing this step because now i need i want to actually um bake um and use the powder to actually set it in we're not gonna really bake but i just want to use the powder um first before doing my brows to just set in everything I do this all the time guys I use my fingers and just apply the um, the concealer under my eyes and try and tap it in as much as I can and also on my forehead on my forehead and down my nose okay so the next step now i'm going to be using my baby powder i love 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 to use my baby powder this is a johnson baby powder i like to use it to actually set my concealer whenever i don't have the translucent powder I use my baby uh, baby powder to actually set my concealer this works wonders you guys it's wonderful it works wonders I just put it under my eyes and the I'm gonna look like a clown so you guys please don't laugh at me So I'm gonna leave that um, to actually set there. Okay, so while we're leaving the powder on my face to actually set, I'm going to be doing my brows. I'm using an angled eyebrow brush to actually draw my brows, and I'm also using this. Um, um, um this um eyebrow gel i bought it from um Discam. um it was on the a elego um shelf as well so yeah so for my brows you guys okay let me take a mirror so that i can actually draw them very well like i can actually see myself drawing them because now the camera is a bit far from me i hope you guys can see how i'm actually doing this
this is how I actually apply my my brows I actually do my brows okay I start with a small line and then I actually lay on that line like going up and up and up until I reach the length of the length I want I want at that time or whatever time so now this is a work um tutorial so I just um do like small bras however if I was going out maybe on a night out or something then it will be uh, maybe a bigger brow and if you can guys uh, if you guys can see I have like the mug so I tend to use my brush and just um, brush it up like that so that it looks like like no more hair and then I go to the other side go to the other side and do the same that is one line and then I apply the other layers on top and go up as I'm doing it go up as I'm doing it until I get to the size that I actually want because you know at daytime uh, makeup during daytime actually I, I wouldn't say that is my preference because I wouldn't say everybody prefers it that way or that's how it should be but during daytime I prefer just having um, small brows not too dramatic just um, small so um, the next step I'm going to be using my LA Girl concealer just to clean up my brows Ooh. oh girl is broke if a girl is broke you can actually see from her makeup now okay let me take my mirror again and actually clean up my brows uh, here we go Ooh. hope you guys can see how I'm actually doing it okay and I'm going to the other side as well going to squeeze it a little as well just to make the, the top one and then I'm just going to spread the concealer on my forehead so that it doesn't have those um, straight lines okay now I've applied my concealer okay now my brows are done so we are going to be moving on to the next step and the next step is um to actually um do my um eyeshadow so remember we actually applied the the powder so i need to just remove the powder from my eyes and also from my under eyes and remove the powder okay now I'm going to be using my old revolution palette as you guys can see very old so I'm going to be using 
this color here this color is actually purple so it looks purple it looks like it looks um a dark brownish but i'm going to be using this color here and some i don't use a uh, too many colors when actually going to work i actually use one color and actually just to make it as simple as just to make myself as simple as i can if you are, if you know what i mean so i'm just going to be applying a little bit of the of the shadow and actually blend it in trying to blend that in and I'm going to take that on the other side as well and try and blend it in as much as I can Okay, so next up, I'm going to be using my um, three-in-one mascara. It's actually, I don't understand why they said three-in-one because it's only one color. So I don't understand what they actually mean by three-in-one, but we're just going to go for it. And then I'm just going to apply that on my lashes hmm. it's dark brownish so you can't actually really say it but i normally um just use this brush because this brush is amazing to actually curl your um your lashes so i use this brush to actually curl my lashes and so this mascara for me like works as a a pre mascara or let me say a primer prime mascara or whatever i don't know i haven't given it a name but this is my mascara before i apply mascara and then i'm going to be using the design um waterproof eyelash mascara this i bought at edgar's it was very cheap i think it was 120 not 120 i'm lying it was 80 rands <laughs> it was actually 80 rands and it does the work guys it's actually black and yeah i love black black is my favorite color so i don't know why i i mm. Look at my eyes, guys, after I apply the black mascara. And it's actually, it's a very nice mascara. I'm going to apply that on my lower lashes as well. And yeah. So for my eyeliner, I don't use an eyeliner, guys. I actually use the, um, the, um, Sorry, my eyebrow gel and actually I use this as my eyeliner as well in some occasions because it looks so it looks amazing. It just looks amazing. I do it like the Indians do it. Do you see that my eyes are popping? I love Indian makeup because they are black. If black is bl black is black, and their makeup pops and actually does the works. So, guys, as you can see, we almost at the end of our makeup tutorial. So now I'm going to use the powder that was left from the powder that I was using. I'm just going to make a line right there. And then another one right here using this as a highlighter there we go and 
I don't really, I don't really, really like use a highlighter when I'm going to work or if I'm going to work and using a highlight, let's say it's a sunny day, um, I feel like glowing, then I just use a little bit of highlighter. Not too much, like when you, like you would maybe when going out on a night out or something. So I just apply just a little for that little um glow and I apply it this side as well can you guys see that it's beautiful oh god there we go there we go there we go Ooh. That looks amazing. I don't know if you guys can see that, but that looks amazing. Now, the last step, I am going to be applying a lip color. This is a... No, not this one. I'm not looking for you. I'm not looking for you, honey. This is an Avon lipstick. And the color is Superb Wine. <laughs> okay. This is my favorite color, guys. This is my favorite lip from Avon. It's amazing. It feels so soft on the lips. However, looks so matte. That's what I love about Avon lipstick. Mm. oh my god mm. I feel like I'm drinking wine already mm. okay now this is the finished look guys I look like I'm going to work already <laughs> So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. This is a simple look for a day-to-day -day, um, uh, work day. And um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please do like and subscribe. And also, if you have any comments about the video, please do leave any comments below. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Thank you. Bye. I look so 